In a recent divorce case file, Jeannie Mai accuses Jeezy of child abuse and neglect. Following their divorce, Jeannie Mai has described specific instances of alleged violence by Jeezy. The most recent document in the divorcing couple's divorce case was filed in Georgia's Fulton County Superior Court on Thursday, and it contained Mai's allegations of domestic abuse, as the Gossip Time examined. In response to the sole survivor rapper's request earlier this month for the court to void the couple's temporary agreement during their divorce proceedings, which temporarily resolved issues like a parenting plan for their two-year-old daughter, Monaco, the former daytime TV host of The Real has filed. Mai expresses in the paper her worries about Monaco's safety in the event that Jeezy is permitted to see their child without the temporary order they had previously decided to be in place. As per the documents, a mediated agreement was reached by both sides in February, when Jeezy was asked to furnish a list of all the firearms in his home and guarantee that they are locked up before he spends time with their kid. Mai asserts that he has refused to comply, arguing that because of purported abuse Mai has experienced in the past, their kid is not secure with her father. Jeezy said, the allegations are not only false but also deeply disturbing, especially coming from someone I loved. In a statement that was shared on Instagram on Thursday, Jeezy stated, My files a counterclaim. Rapper requests a structure for his daughter from the court. This is a stupid attempt at malice to damage my reputation and upend my family. He continued, It's depressing to see the deception and manipulation at work, and for now, my top priority is being an involved father to our daughter while I pursue court-mandated shared custody. The Gossip Time has contacted Jeezy's agents for a statement. Rest assured, the truth will prevail through the proper legal channels. After two years of marriage, Jeezy filed for divorce from Mai in September, claiming that their union was irretrievably broken and that there was no hope for reconciliation.